Hello and welcome to Martin Match. Today we're gonna we're gonna see about flags. We can we can in include any match like like length to width ratio, scale factors, colors ratio, par parallel lines, area, symmetry, perimeter, shapes, etc. Okay, so my guest presenters are gonna show me all these different maths. Here's our first one. What country is this? This is the Russian flag, and I'm going to show you the ratio of length to width. Okay. So the Russian flag's length to width is 2 to 3, but I represented it as 12 to 18 and 6 to 9. Okay, because both of those are in the ratio 2 to 3. Fantastic. Yes. What have we got next? So I have the Indonesian flag over here, and I'm going to be doing scale factor. So the length of the big flag is 8 centimeters, and the length of the four, small flag is 4 centimeters. So uh, 8 divided by 4 is 2, so the scale factor is 2. Okay, so yes, it's width in that case, but yes, scale factor remains the same as 2. Brilliant. Okay, what do we got next? So here is the French flag. Uh, I'm going to be showing you guys the color ratio. So the French flag has, uh, the color ratio is from white to the other colors is 1 to 2. Okay, because they're all equal, and actually that's the name of the French flag it's tricolor so very good three colors excellent um, so i have a flag of germany and i'm going to show you the parallel lines in it so there are a total of four parallel lines this is the one two three and four parallel lines okay so horizontal and vertical parallel lines next what have we got this is the flag of germany okay and i'll be talking about the area so the dimensions are nine centimeters to 15 centimeters and to get the area we have to multiply these together so um, 15 centimeters times 9 centimeters is 135 centimeters. So the area is 135 centimeters. Square. Excellent. All right, thank you. What have we got next? This is also the French flag. I'm going to be talking about the lines of symmetry with colors. So there's only one line of symmetry with colors uh, because if you put a line of symmetry like this, then the two different colors, so it's not a uh, proper. And you can't also make a line of symmetry like this because they're two different colors. Because it's a, and because it's a rectangle, so it won't yeah. be a symmetrical diagonally. Okay, and France and Germany are flags that represent students at our school. And this is the day of uh, international multilingualism. All right, what have we got here? So I have the flag of Argentina without the emblem, and I'm going to be talking about the fraction and percentage. Okay. So the fraction of blue out of the whole flag is 2 over 3, which means the percentage is 66%. Okay, because each of those is equal. So you've got three equal sections there. Wonderful. What have we got next? So th this is the Thailand flag. So I'm going to be talking about parameters. The, the height is 12 centimeters and the, and the width is, is 18 centimeters. We can we can um, add 12 plus 12 or we can we can mu multiply it by 2 so, so 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 12 times 2 is 24 and 18 times 2 is 36 so 36 plus 12 i mean 12 12 times 2 is 24 so 36 plus 24 is 60 okay brilliant so you got the perimeter 12 18 makes 30 double that you get 60. So there we go. That's, uh, if we can see some of those flags, please. We've got one more, to, oh, sorry, one more to go. One more to go. Yeah. That's the French flag. Okay, we've got the French flag again. Yes, and that My is your flag. French flag. Okay. Uh, and um, the, this is full of rectangles. And this is what, sorry, this is? Full of rectangles. Oh, you've got rectangles. Yes, you've got three rectangles there, and the whole flag is a rectangle. So there we go. We can see lots of maths. We had symmetry, we had shape, we had parallel lines, and uh, ratios and fractions. Fantastic. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And goodbye from all. Bye!